check this out 36 degrees man it's burning outside it's so hot uh, now I'm going uh, home to make the climate control on the E39 because since I've uh, installed the turbo kit I uh, didn't have the enough place to put the original auxiliary fan so we have to improvise back home let's do the climate control on this one and uh, <laughs> that's very nice that we have some shadow in here which can work yeah these days yesterday I think I've um, done this pavement so I'm working at cars and I'm working at home at, as well so I have to do that as well but since I've um, worked in here I've uh, destroyed my uh, grinder I think it's called yep because this is not uh, meant for something like that and um, uh, I, I don't know how these pieces are uh, named in English but uh, as you can see one it's completely blown out and the second one is, is so small that uh, it doesn't even touch the rotor on the engine so I already ordered uh, a repair kit I um, have to wait till I receive my uh, parts and after that is going uh, strong again and yeah this is the left uh, parts on the fan so everything is with bolts yeah you need to have some uh, special um, uh, screws or um, something like that S special keys as you can see in here very small star screws so everything comes apart this side as well and um, in some uh, cases the module for the auxiliary fan is going to be outside somewhere in here with a cable but in my case the module was built in the fan itself so I took everything apart and I took the module and it's already in the car I'm going to show you what I've done and uh, let's see if it, uh, this works the biggest cooler fan in the history <laughs> Uh, I'm uh, just testing if the climate control will start because after I installed the intercooler I don't have any place to put the, the auxiliary fan anyway uh, I have the fan in here the wires I have the module in here from the old fan yeah the fan is, it uh, doesn't spin yeah and uh, So the fan works without the climate. Now we are going to start the climate. Oh, and uh, let's see if the fan works. No. Woohoo! It started. So job done. That means I should have climate in. Uh, my turbo E39 so yeah yep that's working everything seems fine let's see if we have cold air oh yeah baby <laughs> Climate control, the temperature is okay <laughs> for now. Oh, cold! It's working. Now I'm going to shut the climate control off. And uh, I uh, will check for the biggest fan in the world if it's spinning still. So it's still spinning, but I think it's going to shut. Woohoo! Look at that! Perfect! And uh, I have a fail safe in here on the ground. I can unplug this if uh, it's going to stuck or something like that. I can unplug it. So 
so now it's off I'm gonna check again climate control on yeah now now we have cold air that's perfect Oh, nice and uh, let's check once again the biggest fan it's spinning oh it's sucking hot air that's good as well so job done guys man look at that 36.5 degrees so Without climate, it will be a nightmare. Now that um, the climate works, we can drive this car. In summer, I mean. With that being said, um, the climate works. That's a bonus point <laughs> for my build. Um, I'm not going to post any more updates till I uh, will receive my other parts. I've already ordered uh, a cat for this car and I have to build some exhaust. Uh, after that I'm going to drive, drive the car to inspection. I will receive inspection and after that we can uh, have some more updates on the car. We can uh, uh, drive it properly with the turbo uh, installed. So meanwhile I'm gonna work uh, on the E90 more. Uh, and uh, this uh, will uh, remain uh, off-camera project till I resolve all that uh, small issues with this and uh, I uh, like I've said I will post updates when uh, the car will be ready to be driven on the road legally I mean <laughs> yeah legally so I hope you enjoyed this episode uh, if you find this video useful please give me a thumbs up if you don't like this video thumbs down until next time see you later